hello friends welcome to my youtube channel in today in this video i will show you how to use path animation in our qtqml application and how to draw any shape in our qtqml application and how to apply the uh, animation on that shape so let's start first of all import here qt quick shape to draw any shape okay now let's create a shape okay now first of all assign the id so let assign the my shape okay also set the width and height so set the width same as that parent parent dot height okay now here you have to create a shape path to create a shape okay now also set here a uh, stroke color and fill color and border width okay so here let's set the stroke stroke color set is uh, let's set it a uh, blue okay so now let's set the stroke width stroke width is a uh, one kind of a line width okay now let's set the fill color to fill the uh, background color just uh, one kind of okay so let's set the uh, red color okay now here we have to provide the start position so let's set a set our start as 50 and start y position is 50 now use a path line to draw any line okay so now let's create a set the uh, x and y coordinates so now let's simple draw a basic uh, square or rectangle okay so i write here some rectangle coordinates so here rectangle have a uh, four lines so i draw the uh, four lines okay now just change the uh, arguments okay so this is the first line and this is second third and ending position okay now let's run the application and check this path So you can see the rectangle is true and this is the border color okay so now let's create a one rectangle okay to a draw a path uh, which is the uh, now let's create a set the id okay so here we use the rectangle and draw a circle okay so now let's set a width is 20 or uh, height is 20 okay let's set the radius to create a circle object so use the circle dot height divided by 2 if you draw any circle object just divide your height divided by 2 this is the radius okay so let's set the color also so now let's set the blue color okay now let's also here you have to set the start position okay now rectangles is also ready now let's run the application and check it so you can see the rectangles is displayed okay so now let's create a one path one path animation so first of all create the path to display and set the path to make an animation so let's set the id first of all my path here we have to also provide the start position and end start location okay so just simply copy this path line arguments here okay now let's create the path line path animation okay so here we have to set the target so first of all set the id So now here, here we have to set the target on which object we have to apply the animation. So we apply this animation on circle object. Okay. So now here we have to set the path. So this is the path. Provide the uh, path where we perform the animations. Okay. So now let's set the duration also. So let's set the uh, two minute, two second duration. Okay. 
and set the loops okay so set the infinite loop okay this animation is continuous running and run equal to true okay now let's run the application and check it so you can see the uh, our circle object is running on the our path lines okay so also you can apply the uh, or change the duration if you want to slow down the path animation just increase the value here and run the application and check it so you can see the animation is slow down so also you can apply or uh, draw any shape as per your need like a star pattern and uh, any other kind of patterns and shape and also you can apply the uh, sh animation on that path so by this way you can easily use the path animation and apply the path animation effect on your shape shape controls or your drawing so please drop your comment if you have any questions about path animation and shape controls and shape path and how to draw on qtqml application and please like this video and share this video with your friends and subscribe to my youtube channel and press the bell icon to get the notification of new video and thanks for watching my video thank you